the Manage Deliverables menu option shows an overview of the linked deliverables. We see the name of the mapped layout, the configured output format of the AutoCAD page setup and the name of the mapped control document. In the next step we define the content type of the published file in the control document. In this configuration we can choose between an original file or an attachment file. There is an indication that this control document was already linked to the file content type original file. Now we are going to validate the current mappings with conditions in the document control system. A correct setup is indicated with the green icons. Let's create a mapping that is not accepted by the system. For example this project configuration only allows one original file per control document. The incorrect mapping is indicated with the red icons. Let's correct the mapping before we start publishing. Of course the validation is also performed if the user starts to publish directly. By selecting the Publish option the drawing files will be converted to the configured output format and uploaded in the document control system. The system asks the user to confirm the current settings because they are saved with the drawing. Standard AutoCAD printing functionality is used to create the output format. The upload status to the control system is displayed in the status column. When all layouts are published the user closes the dialog box.